Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel, Ariatu here naturally as on YouTube, so today I am bringing you a haul video, this will be my February haul, probably will be going out mid-March once all my things come in, but these are pretty much things that I ordered in February and some later things that are from the US that I ordered a while ago but I've only got now. So this is the first portion, so I've got orders from Duke Designs, Planner Face, Whimsical Cat Studio and the mixy mixy cat stuff so hopefully my camera does not die before i finish this portion and no one comes home so i'm going to start with plan face because i've had this the longest and i can't wait to just haul it so this was i shopped during the pvc sale the ups sale actually the ultimate planner sale the um, winter one and i I, I, st I got my order in early so i got all these freebies so i got like a bag of samplers i'm just going to flip through them I'm putting them in separate sides because I know what I'm going to keep. And this is in the silver foil from the Spoil Planner. This is in gold foil. More gold foil. <laughs> More gold foil. It's very sad, isn't it? And then this is a script sampler from the Sticky Situations Situation Club. I might keep that. And then this is from Bean Sprout Paper Coat, and I'll keep that. So, yeah, those were the freebies. So, also another freebie. I got the whole basically a whole kit as a freebie because of how much I spent so this is the every order UPS freebie it's on just regular matte paper you've got two four boxes habit tracker and some functional items then the 25 pound freebie you get four four boxes and then some boxes this is going to be this could be a spring kit actually and then even though I don't have alternate alternative skin tone girl sadly um this is a 50 pound freebie of seen dollars i meant pounds and it has two four six boxes so you've got more than eight already and some more functional stuff then i think this continuation of the 50 pound you've got date covers some more glitter headers deco flags and squared off boxes some doodles and then you get another page with some bottom washi and some more boxes and a weekend banner so basically a full-blown kit that's a freebie which is definitely worth it. The only thing I wish for is having a girl with the alternative skin tone, but you know, I got it for free so I can't complain. Then I also got everything that I bought, I bought in premium mat. So I got this moving day countdown for when I finally know when I'm moving. So it's from three weeks until moving day. So yeah, I got that. And I, the first kit I got is called Love Story. This is going to be in my spring lineup. One thing I love about Planner Face kits is that she comes with your her kits come with freebies, so and they like you don't have to add buy the add on alternative skin tone girls, which I love. So well you do sometimes, but most of them come in the kit. So I got these two are freebies with the kit. So I got a toolbox, and obviously I'm going to be using her. So and I got this one as well. And this toolbox, which I need to use her. I love her. Okay, and this is the kit. So this is the first page. We get um, eight boxes, and then three heart checklists. I'm not a fan of these ones because of the um, labels at the side. We've got date covers, some boxes, deco. I love how small and tiny her deco is. Sidebar stuff. Half boxes, these are rounded off half boxes and quarter boxes and then some squared off down here flags and bill dues we've got some sample of the glitter headers some more boxes and then little things and then some headers yeah it's a dinner and this week one those are the only two i use in the payday and i plan next week that is a very loud airplane i don't know why there's airplanes nobody's going anywhere but yeah sorry about that the page that you know kind of gets neglected we have some doodles up here which i do use if i can and then some um page flags down there this is the bottom washi and then an extra full box and some washi strips and then the glitter header sampler so glitter headers and some half boxes and fancy labels appointment labels and squared off quarter boxes so that was the first kit love story the next kit is called movie night so um, these were I bought as an add-on and these were included in the kit so this is the add-on I bought 
and I bought it for this girl. Um, I don't remember what this art is called, but I'm like, sometimes I'm a fan of her art, sometimes I'm not. I don't know, like this hand for instance, like that you can see the inside of her hand is as dark as the skin and the skin is so dark you can't really see any detail even though it's dark I don't know if I'm making sense but it's dark but you can't see details and the palms are the same colour so it's not realistic and then sometimes the, the way she draws her face and her cheekbones kind of puts me off so yeah I'll probably use one of these girls I don't know which one and yeah these are alternative skin tone options for the um boxes in the kit sorry I can't speak this was the um, add-on box that came in the kit which is the movie night one and then this is the darker skin color and um, version and once again it's so dark you can't really see the details as well like compared to these ones but yeah that's that and here is the kit so we have the same layout, so the alternative skin tone boxes were for these two. I don't know when I would use this but I just, I saw it and I just thought I need it, I, I just need it. So I don't know if this will go in my normal planner or in my fan planner, maybe my normal planner. Because it's, even though it's like a movie night kit, it's not like a pop culture kit. I like these washi strips and this bottom washi. And the glitter headers. And the next kit I got was the Lucky Kit for St. Patrick's Day. Of course, this came, these are add-ons that came in the kit. The alternative skin tone girl, I'll be using her, of course. And I might use her too, just because, I don't know, thinking about Irish people, I think of redheads, I don't know. We will see how many boxes I need. So these are the four boxes. The Jacko and the date covers, the hot boxes. I like that there's only two boxes that have um, things in it because I don't tend to use these boxes much. So I like to have more options of boxes without deco in them because I'm not really, I don't really use them since I use, um, I can't speak today, since I use um, character stickers, kind of get in the way. An extra box, ooh, these pancakes, definitely using that box. And then glitter headers. Yeah, that was my order from Planner Face. My next order is um, a bit kind of used because I am impatient. So this is from Duke Plans on Etsy, Duke Plan Designs, and the um, the shop is included on Bethany um, beingbethanyrose.com. But I bought it from Etsy just because they were already started there. So I got six. Um, monthly kits and these are for my um, fun fan because they're like fun pop culture-y kits. I've used some of them already because once I got them I just kept putting them down and I didn't want to stop. So I'm going to show you the ones I have and then show you the ones that I've laid down because I haven't actually planned for the months. I've just laid them down. So I got a May one and of course I got a Star Wars theme for May because yeah this is matte paper. I wish it was premium matte but you know it's fine. So this is the first page, we've got some characters as well there, we've got our boxes, we've got some um, scripts or typography, some circles and then Monday to Sunday so you can put it start the week whenever you want which is great. And we've got this sidebar section, I wish it was just fully decorative because I don't write my sidebar but I've decided to kind of write one like highlight of one main thing from that month in the sidebar so I'm going to do that. And then these are some of the boxes. Um, as I was saying with the planet face things, I don't like that these things are here because I need I put character stickers so it makes it harder to colour. But it's fine. And there's not a lot of boxes, but um, I did one month and I was okay writing on the paper and I can always pull in boxes. Um, the June one is a... Um, what's this called? It's lost from my mind, but you know what I'm talking about. You know, the Tin Man, the Lion, her, the Red Shoes. The name has just lost my mind. So, but that's what this kit is for June. Because I just thought this was a summary, gave me summary vibes. 
So it's the same layout. I'm really trying to think what this is called, but I don't remember. It's going to bother me now. And boxes, more boxes, and the sidebar. So these are all three, three pages and they don't have like um, date dots, which I, that's fine. Then the July one, I got the Guardians of the Galaxy because it just it felt like it fit. So the are those. These are the headers, the boxes, the dates. And also you see state circles as layering pieces. More boxes. So these are the ones that I've used. I'm going to show you the used page and then show you the spread other than January because I've actually planned it in January. And this is my fan planner, so I don't share that on the internet. So this is the April one, and it was a Alice in the Wonderland theme. So this is what's left from it. And then this is what's left of the boxes since I haven't played and planned for April since we haven't been in April. So let's get you April. This is... Oh. This is April. I used um, date dots from Harriet Wright Design. So this is how I basically set, laid the base down and the Monday to Sundays I put them there and I put the boxes here and then the extra character stickers I put them there to fill up the boxes and I put some in the sidebar and then just left put important and left the space here to write the most important thing of this month. But yeah, that's April. Um, the January one, let's see, have I written in it yet? I don't think I can show you this. Let's see if I can. Uh, no, I have written in it. So, January was a Game of Thrones one, because, you know, winter's coming. But it was basically in the same setup with all the characters at the top, and it said January. This is all that was left from it, so I fully I have planned for January, since we're now in February. And then the February one is... a. Uh, Beauty and the Beast theme, so I love that there were roses in these circles. This is a very crazy haul. And this is all that's left from the boxes since I haven't used them yet, and I had to use a lot of them squared off boxes since there are only four weeks in February. Let's go to February, my birthday month. Okay, so this is the February one, Beauty and the Beast, and I used uh, Harriet Wright Designs date dots again. So, because there's only four weeks in February, which is such a beautiful week, I use the boxes here and then use extra deco kind of in between to fill it out. And then I didn't really have space to put, I didn't have any more left, I only had one left to put here. And I can just talk about, you know, I turned 25 and anything else that might happen in this month, even though I'm almost at the end of it. So that was February's. Okay, so my next order is from the Mixy Cat stuff and she was kind enough to give me a discount code on Instagram to make this order so I did get um was it 15% or 20% off I don't remember but yes um this is a journaling card and it's 2021 a new year with beautiful moments treasured memories and all the blessings on a heart can know I can't read um before this shop is most of the, well, all of her characters are cats if you know me personally or you've heard me say it, I'm not a fan of cats I had I'd had some trauma as a child with some cat with a cat so you know I'm not a fan of cats you know everyone has their things but I don't mind using cat like character stickers I've come to find because like the fox and cat just ones I enjoy using and have these and I've had some other cat um, um, character stickers that I don't mind even though if there's a cat in a full box in a kit I won't use it I don't know why, there's no really or explanation, but I thought I should just say that in case you're wondering. So this is a freebie. So it's got this 2021 um cat. I wish I had this earlier. This one is shopping bar bags. It's got Walmart bags, but you know, there's not that in UK. And then a character face, and then this is like an ice cream truck, no, a delivery truck. So these are all cool. Oh my phone. Okay, so I think I'm going to zoom in even more. The first one that I got was um, stickers to all to like you know like getting new stickers, organizing my stickers, pulling stickers, playing with stickers, anything sticker related. So those are them. This one is a planning 
one. So we've got. Can you see it's the focus? Let's just give it a second. Focus, focus. Okay, so this cat has got a planner, washi. This one has tweezers and a pen, or like an um, exacto knife, and then the washi and a planner again. But these washes are different. So yeah, that's a whole sheet of those. I like the tweezer one. That that's different. And then this is planning. So it looks like a coiled planner. Open, doing some planning, which is how I look always. So a whole sheet of those. And this is the emojis one. This is number one. And these are flirty. I think it's shocked as well. And like angry. Because this one is winking. This one looks angry. She looks shocked. She looks happy. So I think it's flirty and shocked. Or something like that. I needed some more emotion stickers. This is emojis number three, and there's my laughing, crying, laughing, crying, winking one, sad one, and a shy one maybe. It's hard for me to tell the expressions on these cats, but it's a whole sheet of those. And then this one is the zoom one for all my zoom lectures. I was shy. I've had the same ones and. You know, who knew one year later I would still be needing them. So I wanted to kind of re-up so I could have a more of a variety. Especially when I have more than one Zoom call in a day. And I do mark them all so I could have a variety of stickers to mark them. So we got them in different colours. So very neutral. I think I've got them in a neutral colour because there's an N down there. So I probably did get them in the neutral colour. Then I got the breakfast one. I need some more breakfast stickers. Oh, pancakes. Yes, I can use them in my spread. Um, so breakfast, toast, pancakes, cereal, and just a normal breakfast, so yeah. Great. Probably use all of them apart from this one because I don't really eat cereal. This one is cooking, so we've got frying, we've got a pot, chopping, and just like a chef. I like the pot ones because I don't always cook like in a pan and I'm tired of always using the chopping ones. So we've got a variety of those. And then this is a pizza one because me and my husband, we love pizza. We get pizza every time we don't want to eat like food at home. We're like, pizza. It's either pizza, um, burgers, or kebab. But pizza is usually number one. So it's a pizza one because I love pizza. And I didn't have enough stickers for those. I didn't have, I've never bought like a dedicated pizza sheet, I've always bought like the mixed fast food sheet. This one is chicken, fried chicken, so for KFC and stuff, or chicken chips. So that's pretty much self-explanatory. And then I got some petrol ones because I don't have any more petrol stickers and the ones I have are like humongous. So I needed more, so these ones are like a, a, pink, like a pinky red and like a turquoise bluey green colour. Just normal petrol stickers and I got these ones which are a little bit different and they say gas on it and they're red. Yeah. And this one is just a driver one because I don't have car like normal car stickers either, so I wanted some of those. And then this one is a sleeping sticker. For like when I um sleeping or like I'm marking a lazy day or whatever so that was from the mixy cat stuff and the next order in this installment is from whimsical cat studio um i remember the last time i ordered it was like right basically almost a year ago because it was right at the beginning of the pandemic and the shipping took forever because i think she's based in the philippines or they or she i don't know um and the philippines were not shipping so everyone's orders were stuck so I was like kind of skeptical to order again but 
I could I just I had been watching a lot of hauls that I'd had stickers from her that had been coming on time and also she has new she has a premium matte paper now which is kind of like thoughts and cactus paper and I was like okay that's and she like reform reformatted some of the stickers so I was like maybe I should give them a try so these are some freebies because I'm pretty sure and I'm 100 percent sure I didn't order this so this is like a variety sort of sheet so we've got plying up here which definitely I'll use some crying stickers, which I'll use definitely too. This is veg stickers. I don't know how likely it is for me to use this. Maybe if I ate a salad, something. Maybe the dog cuddling one, I'm definitely not going to use those. And then more veg. But this is the first freebie. And then I got, is it two ballerinas? I've got two ballerinas. Which are cute. I'll probably give these away because I don't really have a use for them. Another freebie with a planning one, a cup of tea, a dog, a love heart, a cat, and like, like swimming stickers, which I actually bought this sticker. So I keep majority of them and give it away. The rest I won't use. This one's riding a unicorn. It's cute, I guess. And this one is on the new paper. Um, plant. And my plant mum with some pink hair, which is cute. Okay, now for the stickers. So of course, I've got a couple of stickers because I need I need a couple of stickers always, even though I have plenty. But I just like to have a variety. You know, though now I don't go anywhere. I'm always with my husband, but you know, just a lot of different things we do together. So this is one of the newer sheets in the premium matte paper, and the boy is called Will, and the girl is called. Myrtle or something like that. So this is them. This is a hugging sheet. Um, this is like a kissing. So all the ones at the front on the new paper, I separate them already. This one is like cuddling in bed, sleeping. This one is the like, wedding one to mark because I like to mark like when we've been married one month, two months. I guess I'll do that for the first year, so I thought I might need those. And then this is like sitting on the couch watching stuff and um, driving. I kind of wish there was like an option to have the girl in the driver's seat as well as just a boy, but you know, there's a boy and a girl in a car, so if we're doing it running errands. And then this is like budgeting, just to note when I budget. Planning, because that's what I do. Ordering food, because <laughs> that's what I do as well. For when I do order takeout. This is a teacher one, that's a cat, and this is on the old paper. So all the ones with the blue backgrounds are on the old paper. It's like, a, it's a matte, it's a normal matte, but it's a little bit more than a premium. Like it's a little bit more than like the basic matte. It's kind of a little one up. Like paper shire sort of paper, like first sort of paper that paper shire had. It reminds me of that. But it just, it doesn't really stick well in my reusable sticker book, I'll say that. It's very frustrating. So this is teacher ones for, you know, teaching. Um... I think this is um, waking up late. Mm -hmm. That's why, oh my God, sorry. That's why she looks panicked. Swimming in stickers for when I get my happy meal or when I'm uh, organizing stickers. Filming, this one is like filming a haul, but I can use it for like filming um, plan with me too. This is a repurchase because I finished the other one. A washi lover sheet because I've been getting into washi a lot more. I'm like, when I organize my washi or do things with washi, I would like to mark that or just planning stuff too and then this is the filming plan with me sheet i wish there was a sheet that just had these alone because i've got these already but there isn't so yeah as you can see there's a planner under here and then this one is like doing essays or assignments and this is usually how i feel before doing essays so it's accurate breakfast one Um, planning, it's got like pens, 
so I could use this the pen one especially for when I'm doing my um what I, I call it fun planning just it's easier which is when I plan by myself in my fun planner and I do write in that one so this would be good to mark that this is um the boy bay gaming and just to, uh, just another sticker to uh, mark when my husband is gaming which is every day anyways but if I do mark it and then another one laying in the bed and this is like the older format and then eating takeout Chinese which we did yesterday so I could use this for that yeah so that was my order from the whimsical cat studio so that was this first section so I'll see you in a second when the rest of my things come Okay, so this next shop is Bella Plan Ella, and I shopped um, during the TPC sale, oh, the February one. So I'm going to start off with the freebies and go with the kit. So I was so excited when I saw the theme, and I love Once Upon a Time. I haven't finished it because I have a very short attention span, and I always end up rewatching shows. But I love Once Upon a Time, and when I saw that this was the theme, I was so excited. So this is the journaling card, which is amazing. Look at Emma and Henry and what's his name? Hook. So that's the journaling card and then it has the once upon a time. And then I requested another one where well, I put my name in the notes because I wanted my freebie again because the other one I have been holding it and I actually want to use some of these stickers and this full box. So I was like, I need another one so I can use this and hold the other one. So here's my freebie. So um that will obviously let you know that I do PR for Bella Plant Ella. If you would like my freebie and 50% off your order, use the code ADIATI15. And if she's having a sale already, just put my names in the notes to sell out to get my freebie also. So here's my freebie. And then these are the sale freebies. So um, this is the £5 freebie. So it's got glitter headers and some icons on it. And then this is the Facebook freebie where I put the Facebook code in the notes to sell out. And then it is an overlay. Oh, and it says all magic comes with a price dearie which is what one for one or whatever his name is says or oh, gold and then this is his knife rumple rumple skills i can never say it but if you know you know right it's in gold so obviously because that matches with this kit the most so i'm so upset about but i'm just going to use it because it's going to be in my fan planner We've got one set of underlays and for the way I'm going to use it, I think it's going to work because I don't have enough full boxes. So on the day that I don't have full boxes, I can use this and just do more planning on that day. I don't know if that makes sense, but it's the, this is a £35 freebie. I'm not doing it in order, clearly. This is a £15 freebie. So you get Hook and Emma. You get a weekly box, some paint labels. Um, habit trackers and some free heart checklists this is the 25 pound freebie both pages so you get four more boxes so in total you get five boxes some half boxes of court boxes and some heart checklists and three heart checklists then you get your date covers and then some more boxes and then two more glitter head sets of glitter headers so i can pretty much use this just add in my own bottom washi and that and figure out what to do about extra box but I can do it and obviously use extra boxes but I do that anyway so this is the f this is all just three weeks I haven't paid for any of these yet and um, look how generous it is so those are the freebies now for what I actually ordered I'm going to start with the foil items I didn't get any custom scripts this time because I didn't need any but I did make an order right after of custom scripts so this is the um, St. Patrick's Day stuff so I got it in the I think emerald green so this is the quote boxes. So it says Irish kisses and shamrock wishes. Um, happy St. Patrick's Day. Lucky and blessed. Shake your shamrock. Which is, I think it's so funny. Then I got the underlays. I've, I got four of them. Because that's more than enough for me to do a whole base. So they've got like pots of gold and uh, shamrocks. Or clovers. So I've got four of those. There's four in a page. So you get 16. Can I do maths? Or 8, 12, 16. Yeah, 16. I don't know why I doubt in my maths for a second. I promise you I can do maths. And I got this for that foodie kit, that kit, um, art, that kittenish girl, um, kittenish 
girl Jess came out with. Um, I didn't buy the kit from Bella Planet Bella Plant Ella because I had bought it already, but I definitely wanted these overlays. So I got the full box overlays that say fries before guys, WTF, where's the food? You had me at tacos and I want pizza, not your opinion. So these three, I think I'm the one that I'm going to use definitely. This one maybe if I have room, but it's just so amazing, especially the pizza one. I love pizza. And I decided to get it in a holographic foil because I'll be using sparkly holographic foil um, for that kit and she, and this was the closest to it. So I'll be using sparkly holo and holo because I'll have more holo scripts in sparkly holo. And I'm excited for that kit. I don't know when I'm going to use it, but yeah. And then this, oh, like Rach, she, she, she is the queen of like personalized underlays. So can, can you see the burgers and the fries and the pretzels in these underlays? So obviously I had to get them. So I got four of these for my spread for that kit. And look at this, I also obviously got in hollow. But look, look at the detail. Like, who has personalized underlays for your for each kit? Bell and Planet, like, that's who. Um, so yeah, that is my foil order. Now for the kits, I'm gonna go with like mini kits. Technically it's not a mini kit because I bought each of the pages a la carte, but these are for my B6 planner because I like using her kits for that as well because it, it can last me two weeks. So I've got the glitter headers. This kit is called Egg Hunt. I've got the glitter headers. Um, the reason I didn't get the full kit of this is because I used this artwork in my planner last year for Easter and I don't like using the same artwork twice in the same form, but because it's in my like, um, what is it called? In my P6 planner, I didn't mind so much. So these are, I got the full box page in the darker skin tone because of course, then I got the boxes page, all of these functional boxes. I then got the washi page and the date covers and the date dots. So I end up using this on one and then this on the on another. And it works out really well. So that was the egg hunt kit. I then got in the luck of the Irish kit, which is the St. Patrick's Day kit, as like my mini a la carte sheets. So I got the glitter headers. The full box with the darker skin tone. Um, then I got the boxes. And the bottom washi and date dots. So that was all of the like mini kits. And now for the full kits. And then these are in her new format which I'm so excited for. I can't wait to actually plan with it. And I don't know when I'm using most of these kits. Well, I know when I'm using one of them, but this one, I don't know. This is for my fun planner, of course. And it's called Zero to Hero. And it's like a Hercules um, Greek goddess inspired kit. And I was excited to get this. And of course I got the deeper skin tone. So these are the four box pages, page. This is the four box page. So you get two, four, six, eight four boxes in this, well, this is the same as the old one, but you get um, the same amount of four boxes on this page. So changes happen already. So you get only four four um, heart checklists, which is great because I never use heart checklists. And then you get some appointment labels and some half boxes, a pattern version and a plain version. I'm so excited about all these boxes, like you don't understand. Next page, you get two extra four boxes, which is like a Pegasus. And then this is meant to be like Hercules as a woman, but yeah, great. And then you get two um, weekly boxes, you get some square off boxes, half boxes, um, point, no, fancy labels, and then some third boxes, I would say these are. So all the boxes, I'm so excited. And look, look at this, look at this page, guys. Just take a moment to look at this page. Yeah, so we get these like label things, so kind of like little things without the icon. And then fancy labels, third boxes, half boxes, and then these are washi strips that are a little bit like, these two are the same. This is a little bit bigger and then this is bigger. So we get all of the labels and then we get that same page in a um, pattern formed. <laughs> I, got, I got boxes galore and I'm so excited. And then we get some more fancy labels up here. Then we get two habit trackers, two big do's, some scripts and then glitter headers included in the kit now. And then you get the double box scene and then the um, deco. Some which is also included in the kit now, and we get some 
words where are you like functional icons and stuff weekend banner oh i love this plan i'm definitely gonna use that some work labels the bottom washi page which is into three strips and um, this one is a 50 millimeter i don't know if these two together are 50 millimeters more or less but yeah then we get our date covers and our date dots and the hearts this page didn't change that was the first kit the next kit is when i saw this artwork i literally i was so excited and i messaged jess and i was like thank you like thank you this hair just looks like me and when I actually have my like actual proper wedding when COVID is over I want my hair to be out and curly and beautiful like this and I was so excited when I saw this I'm going to use this kit for my um, wedding anniversary the, my like traditional wedding that I had because who knows what I'm going to do in the bigger wedding for the pandemic and I'm sure I'll find a different kit or just try and find this artwork again so it's called A Thousand Years and of course I chose the darker skin tone, the only thing with this kit, um, Jess didn't, because there were so many like couple variations, I know she did a vote and she did like random couple variations rather than matching, so I didn't have the other couple matching like in my skin tone, but that's fine. Um, I have this one, so that's fine. But yeah, the ones from the back is the one I wanted, but I can get it, sadly. But yeah, anyways, let's just continue. So these are the full boxes. So um, it's just amazing. It says, how sweet it is to be loved by you. This beautiful wedding scene, the wedding dress, um, like the invitation, a couple scene, and then the bride with all her natural hair. She's so beautiful. Then we get the same layout as a new one. So I'm not going to talk for it because, you know, you know the drill now so this is what i mean these couples they were like random like random hair colors and skin color skin colors and stuff and even though the guy with the darker hair would have you won't really be able to see the skin i would know and i'm a bit picky with these things so i just thought just not get that in general so but we get another extra box that so i could use this one then we got our label pages label. i love these patterns Especially these three. The green, I like the pattern, but I, I'm not a fan of green that much. But I love these patterns so much. Oh, and this colour. I think I just love these three tones of like the pinky, nudie, ready sort of tones. I love those tones. These the deco, and then you get the big double box scene, which I think is the same as the double box in the kit. Yeah, it's just a bigger version, so I'm just going to use that one rather than using both. And then the bottom washi, I love this. And that is all I got from Bella Plan Bella. So I'll be back with the next instalment. So my next order is from a new to me shop and it is called Planner Hanna and it's a shop on Etsy. So this is the journaling card, which is this cool like, alien theme. I think she has an underlay box with this design and then the journaling car says she wrote my name and it's just a thank you card and then I got this oops bag which I can tell the oops on all of them actually so it says slip luck s-h-i-t and it's, I can see that it's miscut which is what the oops is this one says I feel like s-h-i-t she has a lot of um of what's the, what's the word to describe it profanities in her like scripts and stuff so this one is a little bit miscut but it's not too bad it's just misaligned a little bit but most of the text is there and it is hard to lift up well this one I already tried to do it but no never mind it's it's fine it's just miscut but it's it's you can still see the whole sticker whereas this one these ones are okay but the ones at the edge like some of the stickers cut off if you can see but you know silhouette issues for you but it's an oops bag and these ones are like the disney princess characters they haven't been foiled yet and these heart had these this half has been cut off but the rest are fine so I might use them or play around with foil once maybe sometime and try to foil it and then these are two underlay boxes this one is the Moana one in 
gold. Um, they seem to be cut very well. Um, I'm not sure what the oops is, it might be foiling. But it doesn't look too bad to me, but I won't be using this anyways because I don't use gold. So this will be in my do stash. And then this other one you can tell, which is sad because I do use silver. This one is a Beauty and the Beast theme. And you can see that there's just lots of stains on it. Which is very sad. Is it cut? It is cut, though. But yeah, so that would be d stash 2. So that was the freebies. Oh, another one. And this one is in black, too. Which I kind of wish it was foiled. But I don't mind that it's in black, either. So it says, I love you. And that's the beginning of the end of everything. And it's got a heart, a um, eggplant, some underwear, date night, and cuddles. That's the freebie. And then I got some scripts. So I got house scripts for House MD. I don't remember what um words, where are you? I don't remember what um font number I used, but I know I got the scripts in black. So house for house MD, criminal minds, and I got two of the criminal minds because um yeah. I knew I need them. I got these like video camera ones. And I believe um, I got them in the mini size. So I got them in black, rose, gold and silver, which is my usual free. Um, and as far as the foiling, there's like a oops here. And a bit misfoiling here, but other than that, it's not too bad. And then in the silver one, there is a few more noticeable oops. But because they're so small, you can't really notice them unless you're really looking, which I am. I'm someone who looks for oops in Fortis because I had a very bad experience once upon a time with a shop that I no longer shop from. So then I got these YouTube ones which I'm excited for. So I'll use this to mark uploading, to march, to march, wow words, to mark like YouTube um, binges and all of that stuff. So I got them in black, rose gold and silver. So this will be good for my um, um, B6 planner as well. So rose gold. This foiling is pretty perfect, and the silver is pretty perfect too, which is good. Yeah, so that's that. Then I got YouTube binge in silver, rose gold, and um, black. So um, I got these two in the same font, I guess. Are these the same? No, they're all three of them are different fonts. So. This one I struggled to take it off and I ripped it, but it seems to be cut well. So, YouTube binge, YouTube binge in a different font, in rose gold and then in silver. And this is like a farmhouse font, I think. And yeah, that's that. And then I got this bundle, I forgot what this one was called. I think it's called the I Love You bundle or M I L Y. And it's in a pink hollow, which is one of my favourite like final foil colours. So, in her bundles, you get these um, food um, doodle icons. Which is great. And then it's like, some of them are repeated. Then you get these like, functional stuff. There's two sets of them, so phone, envelope, pills, etc. Oh, there's a Game Boy here, I can use that for marking my DS. And I got two of those um, icons that I bought. Then you get some date dots, two sets. Some um, headers, these have oops on it. So these are some header overlays. Oh, focus. And as you can see, there's like a big oops here and there, which I tried to scratch off. It was a little bit worse. I thought it, I could rub it off, but it wasn't rub it off. But um, am I too fast? Maybe I am. Let's see if I can avoid using them and then I'll decide if I'm too fast. And then these are dividers, I believe. I don't know if I'm going to use these. I have maybe put them over the four boxes or they stash them. Then we got two sets of the bottom washi. They're like 15 millimeters. And then two pages of bougie boxes and the hearts, the heart doodles. And then the script sampler, which has seven work labels and then loads of other scripts and a weekend banner. 
and it's got some profanity and stuff on there but I'm excited to try some of these scripts and they have all different fonts so that yeah so that was my order from Planner Hannah okay next we have Simply a Mess who has now reopened and I'm super duper excited about that because I missed her um, she's reopened and has had a lot of changes. She's now a ready to ship shop, so that means that her stock can sell out. She's changed her format and things that are available. So I have to adjust to that because of the way I used to buy kits from her. But yeah, so this is a, the gelling card for my order, which was made in February. Since this is a February haul. And then this is the freebie February 2021 freebie. So we've got the Luke's Diner Cup from Gilmore Girl. So she has this in her shop now. We've got the Luna couple, our couple. This says I need coffee, coffee in an IV, hello spring and jumbo coffee morning, which is basically Lorelei needs coffee and IV basically. So that was where that phrase came from, I think. So I'm gonna talk through the format in the first one and then just flip through in the, the rest. I don't have, do I have an old kit from her? Possibly, if I haven't used it, yeah I do. Let's get it. Just give me a second. I didn't plan on doing this, but I thought might as well, since I'm going to be talking about it. I don't really have kits that last long that from her shop. In my collection, I usually use them as soon as I have room for a kit. But this is a kit that waiting for some underlay tapes to arrive before I can use it. Okay, so this is a kit from an old Simply a Mess kit. So, they're both in premium matte. Um, this is a mini kit. This is a mini kit and some add-ons, like, and some a la carte pages which are not available now. So, the first page is the same, but as you can see, the header has changed and all of that. And this kit is called Gent Gentle Giants, so it is part of the Harry Potter inspired kits. I think all the ones I bought were Harry Potter inspired. So we've got the Deathly Hallows there. And this says they're quite gentle really. So yeah. And then this, these hands, I chose version two for the darker hands, but I don't like that. The palms are the same color and we, we've spoken about how I feel about that. It just all looks like it blends together and with Apple. So I don't know if I will even use that box, but yeah. So that page is the same still. This is page two, so uh, obvious change is the um, heart checklist. These are half heart checklist, these are full. The weekend banner is the same and the deco stuff is the same. The scripts are pretty much the same with just a new font. I'll show it closer up after. The date covers are the same, a newer font. We've got the movie marquee and then here, there's been change here, there's more labels here. Well, these labels have been moved to the side and then we've got some icons. Um, two or three habit trackers and then a build do. So I'll show you that close up. So that's page two. And page three has changed as well. So we still got the weekly box and then all the functional boxes down here. Then we have more, um, we've gotten rid of these labels and the free heart checklist, which I was sad about. We've got a half box and some icons, and then instead of to-do headers, which no one really uses anymore, we've got some um, like functional, not functional, we've got some like fun headers that are to do with the theme of the kit. So that is page three. Whoa. Okay, page four is a little bit different too, but we've still got our go headers, we've still got our word headers, but the bottom washi is split into two, so we've got like a glittery one and then a patterned one, and then instead of the icons, because they're in the kit now, we've got flags, so we've got longer flags and short flags. And then for the other kits, I usually add on um, the this page, but this page is not available a la carte anymore. And then also I usually would add on a, oh, I do have it. We usually add on the um, label sampler, which was not available when I was buying these kits, but as of now they are available. And then if there are like fashion girls, they are, those add-ons are available, but you cannot buy the um, 
little things page a la carte anymore so yeah i would have to i'll have to think about whether i want to just go ahead and buy the full kit and just waste one page because i always used to buy the mini kit and the little things page because i didn't want to buy the full box checklist page but we'll see so that was the first kit and the next ones i will just flip through them normally i'm sorry if you didn't really care about that comparison but i did care about that because i shot from simply mess quite a bit let's zoom in a little bit so this one is the lunar kit it's called um wits beyond measure and it's about luna so another harry potter inspired kit so these are the four boxes Then we've got this second page we have the blues and pinks and then these are the this has just blue these look almost like snow head um headers on this page so they change oh that, i didn't notice there was a controller there that is fun and then the glitter headers and then the bottom washi split into two that was the Luna inspired kit. I'm saving this for when I start my Harry Potter um, marathon again. Well, it's like I've done it in, in the past, but yeah. So this one is called Astronomy, and I think this is also Harry Potter inspired. I might be wrong, but I just like this. These are all for my fun plan I've had and I hadn't mentioned already. Which is why it being a mini kit is not too bad. So these are the four boxes. There's some um, deco. So these are like moon phases for the for like the fun headers. I'm going to call them fun headers because it's easier. And then the bottom washi split into two. So this is not good with some celestial like foil. So that was my order from Simply um, Mess. Okay, and then the next order in this section is from Paper Sheet Plans, and this was during her um, birthday sale. Not birthday sale, her four year anniversary sale, so that's it. And I shocked it and broke my nose bend, but it's okay. I did it for you, Claudia. So let's go with three Bs first. So yeah, it was her four year anniversary. So this was the all orders freebie. So we've got this full box, which is part of the kit that I have. So I have this box like some eight times now. Um, some deco, squared off boxes. So I might use this in my um, basic planner because I'm gonna have leftover boxes. So yeah, we've got that as a freebie. Then we, everyone got this die cut from the Botanica kit. And it's, this one is, that one's in matte, just regular matte. This is in a glossy paper. So I'm guessing it is a sticker. Watching her studio vlog, I know it is a sticker. But yeah, yeah, it's a die, sticker die cut. And then this journaling card is so cute. So we've got both colours. But yeah, I love this journaling card. It's good quality. And this girl is cute. I just love this artwork anyways. So then I got some foil. I got her foil sample art to... Um, Try her new foil colour which is iridescent to see how it compared to hollow. If I could use it together or if I liked one more. As of now I feel like they seem very similar to me. But yeah. Yeah, very similar to hollow. Then I got some Harry Potter overlays for, you know, my Harry Potter plan kit. And I got it in the black foil. Um, yeah, we've got some full box overlays strobed ones and just ones with patterns and then I got a deco sheet also so I love that it's black foil because it's more shiny than it just being in black ink you can see the shine there we go okay so now for the first kit this kit is in glossy the other two are in premium app. so many pages okay so this first kit is called botanica Oh no, this page, these pages are not from this kit, are they? Oh, I guess they are. So, we get these two freebie boxes. Well, they're not freebie boxes, they're part of the um, kit, the large kit, which is usually like a double box, you know, something. Um, and it's two boxes that are already in the kit, kind of zoomed out. So that's what I was saying, that I would have these boxes extra, even though this box is in the freebie anyways. 
stir. I don't know which one I'll use. I might use, I think I'll keep the ones that are in there for the kit and use this in my basics. So here are the four boxes. I obviously chose the darker skin tone. This is giving me spring vibes. A page that just always goes to waste. Then this is the min um, the little things pages, and we've got some little things header size or little thing size boxes there that don't have that icon, which I always love. We've got a boxes page, got half boxes and some quarter boxes, builders which can be used as boxes, and then um, um, uh, appointment labels. Ooh, I haven't. I don't think I've bought a kit in her new format, like her newest format. So these are washi header, washi strips, half boxes, and appointment labels again. I wish there was less um, washi strip. I mean appointment. Oh, words! I wish there was less half boxes because I don't use them so much. But I'll cut them down. Some more washi strips. These are plain ones, and then we've got the double um, bottom washi, and then some patterned washi down here. And then we've got our sidebar functional stuff, some fancy labels, flags, some headers, um, work labels, checklists. I don't think I've got glitter headers for any of this. No, I didn't, but I have many. So, and then some deco date covers, and um, some more sidebar stuff, and some boxes. And then we've got a load of deco down the side, which is cute. So that was a bit tiny. I think I deliberately didn't get glitter headers because I have a lot that I can like put in so if I have to buy them separately and it's not like super like unique colours I'll just not buy them so paper sheet plans kit number two in a premium mat peachy um, paper sheet plans premium mat it's not the buttery like smooth one it's more of the eggshell one I heard people call, call it so it just feels like thicker paper so this is the um, two um, extra boxes so these don't seem to be in the kit, which is good. This is like the bottom of her dress. And then this is a stack of books on the bed, which is good. So I have choices of which boxes to use. This is also another spring, maybe like May, just before summer. For me anyways. So I love this girl, she's so beautiful. So of course, darker skin tone. Um, these are the boxes. This is giving me rose gold vibes and more of the pinky rose gold page I don't use. So same format that I just showed you. I really like this bow. It's a shame we'll be separated. Like I like simple washi where I can use all the fancy um, overlays on. This sticker really matches this kit. So that was the second kit that I bought. And then the third and final kit is called Easter. So this is my Easter kit. I'm using two Easter kits because Easter Monday is on the following week. So yeah, so these are the add-on boxes which are not in the kit. So I think I might be using both of these boxes probably because I won't be using that one. Okay, this is also on a premium mat. So here are the four boxes. I'm glad that um, I kind of was looking for artists who did, or well not artists, shops who cut out this girl's face because I didn't really like her face because her cheeks looked really puffy. I, mean, I don't know, it just looked weird to me. So I'm glad. And this artist doesn't do toes, which freaks me out a little bit, can you see? But it's okay. I can't draw half as good as this, so who am I to judge? So I like this and it's like we've got bunny crossing instead of animal crossing so there's the four boxes the checklist might as well just pull those out because I won't be using them um, little things boxes more boxes bottom washi functional and some more functional stuff and that was my order from Paper Chic Plan. So um, I removed the audio from this footage because I was saying I was going to see you soon. But it turns out that this is the end of the video because I have an hour's worth of haul footage, which I didn't know I did. I had. 
and I decided to split the February haul into two parts this part and then the second part will be my US stuff so if you haven't already make sure you subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next haul I hope you enjoyed it make sure you look down in the description box to see all the shops I had mentioned list down below and I either have referral links or like discount codes for any of the shops they will all be down there so I'll see you in the next one bye